Hello and welcome to the uh, episode 23, I think it is now, of the Malaga save. As promised, I'll bring you another episode over this weekend, the second one. Um, we haven't played any more games since the previous episode, so if you haven't already spotted in the top right corner, go back and check out the other one. Uh, because up here is the spoiler. Uh, we beat Schalke 5-0 and Real Sociedad 3-0 in the league, so... Yeah, happy with the pre well happy with the uh, previous episode, but now we get into this one. Uh, we play Sevilla in the league in the Liga and Lazio in the UEFA uh, Champions League. Uh, UEFA, sorry, not, <laughs> not at all. It's in the Europa League. Uh, in the second half of the episode, so let's get into this first game against Sevilla, and this is how we're going to line up for this one. Rea starts in goal with Pazlak, Belejo, Suta and Pavlovic at the back. Ren and Lodi on the left wing. Kaidi Bear in the central defence, uh, central midfield there. Batista Mayer on the right side. And you got Oscar that steps in for Pedri, just to give Pedri a bit of a break really. Gungor has earned his spot in the uh, starting eleven for this one after his performance in the previous game. And uh, Cortez up alongside him. So, uh, oh, and also to note, Dennis Dragas has picked up a slight knock, so he's not going to be featuring in this game. He returns tomorrow to training. Um, so he he drops off the bench as well. Okay, so let's get into this first game against Sevilla. And uh, hopefully carry on from where we left off last episode. Let's give him a team talk. Assertive... Um, Keen to avenge. Uh, yeah, I think it's going to be keen to avenge. No, carry straight on from where you finished last match. That's fair. Passionately say faith. And let's crack on. Um, one thing I failed to know, uh, failed to mention rather in the previous episode was I have now started a Twitter account as well, which is going to be in the link down below in this episode and in the previous episode so head on over there follow me on Twitter um, I'm very new to Twitter as well <laughs> I've never used it before but I thought you know most YouTube uh, content creators use it as they go close thankfully missed uh, use it to help promote their videos and reach a wider audience so I figured I'd, I'd try and do the same um, yeah. <laughs> so, uh, anyway, back to the game. And we're 1-0 down. 1-0 down. Tammy Abraham scores against us. That's deflating. Especially after the high I was on from the previous episode. Um, so, yeah, he, he just basically picks up the ball, beats his man, and fires it home. Not good. Come on, lads, let's demand some more. Come on. We got this. We can do this. We can do this. But we're not doing this. Come on, lads. What's going on here? To be fair, they've had the... They've had the much uh, better game. Assertive. I expect to see much better showing in the second half. Absolutely do. Assertively say there's more to come. That is a 100% true. Shout. Demand some more again. Come on. It's their free kick. We sort of head it clear. Oscar now picks up the ball and runs with it. Plays it in to try and find Gungor but can't and now they have the ball coming at us come on let's try and win the ball back let's pressurise them let's get into them we're just kind of letting them play around us really oh, that's a great tackle eh? I thought that was a great tackle Ren and Lodi has come to me and said he's not happy with the playing time he's getting and now he questions are being asked as to what or rather 
not questions being asked, but um, uh, who we bring on? I think we've got to bring Oscar off, haven't we? Oscar, or in fact, Cortez is having a poor game. So what we'll do is we'll bring Cortez off, put Brocalo out there on the on the right, move Gungor across there. Yeah, that was not good from Renan uh, from Renan Lodi. That's a poor tackle. Bracalo ball in. It wasn't Bracalo at all. It was Bracalo that had the shot. Ah, uh, come on, Batista Mayer, Paslak, Mayer, Oscar Mayer, Oscar. We're going the wrong way with it. Finds Bracalo. He struggles to beat his man. Pavlovic back to Bracalo. Drives inside and then fires high and wide. Well, not wide, but high. Bracalo needs to stop shooting because he cannot do it to save himself. I've told him. He's uh, In fact, I'm pretty sure he's on a... Uh, what's it to say? Yeah, shoot less often. Dribble more and run wide with the ball. He's doing neither of it. Cross more often. Instruction, run wide with the ball, instruction affected by player traits. Really? Run wide with the ball. Okay. Stop being so selfish, Bracalo. Is what I'm basically trying to tell you. Let's bring, do we bring, uh, I think we've got to bring Jonas Wind on for Gungor as well. Come on. Let's uh, switch him up to deep line attacking. Shout. Let's uh, show some passion, lads. Come on. If we can nick an equaliser, that'd be something. But uh, we're 2-0 down now. Just not good at all. Not good. Hmm. Questions need to be asked. Demand more. Pause. Let's. I mean, we went a man down, so at one nil down. And since then, we had a couple of uh, moments where we could have nicked an equaliser, but uh, didn't seem to happen. So I'm thinking about now maybe resting players. Because this game has definitely gone. I'm thinking Pedri for Pavlovic. But Sir uh, Bricardo can't play back there either, can he? No, so that's not going to work. I was trying to take uh, Pavlovic off. Hmm. Although, uh, Pazlak can play on the left. Uh, so we'll do that to get Pavlovic off. Just to save him for the uh, the uh, Europa League. That seems to be where my main focus is going to be this season while we're in it. Because you know, it's our first season in it. So let's uh, go for it, as it were. That was not good enough today. Absolutely not. Not happy with that at all. And then Lottie's banned for a match. Confirm. Spot the rest of that one, yeah. Right, okay. Well, that was a poor game. Let's move on to the more exciting Europa League against Lazio. Right, this is the uh, team we're going to take into the Lazio game. Uh, we've got Rare in goal with Bartolek. Uh, Sal steps in for uh, Vallejo, who we've dropped to the bench. And uh, Sutar Pavlovic. We've got Batista Mayer on the right hand side with Caldor on stepping in for Kylie Bear in the centre there. Renan Lodi keeps his spot for this game because this is Europa League. He's only uh, got a ban for the league game. Pedri comes back into the team for Oscar. Dennis Wind. Uh, Den I keep calling him Dennis Wind. It's not Dennis Wind. It's Jonas Wind. Steps in for uh, Gungor because Gungor is not registered for the Europa League. And uh, Cortez up alongside him. So let's get into the third game 
of the group stage for Europa League against Lazio. Um, yeah, let's uh, see what happens in this one. I guess I'm not expecting anything from the last from this game, but um, I wasn't expecting anything from the Schalke game, and we smashed them five now. <laughs> so you know, it is what it is. I guess. Uh, nobody expects us to get a result. No. Underdogs. Maybe. I think we've got to go with the underdogs one. Let's get. Uh, that had no effect at all. But give them the faith anyway. Come on, lads. We got this. We can do this. It's the away game against Lazio. Ren and Lodi with the free kick and almost puts it in the net. That was not far wide. Now Ren and Lodi bursting down the left wing. Can he redeem himself after the previous game getting sent off? Pedri, uh, yeah, Pedri with the long range effort. Forcing the save from the keeper. Batista Mayer crosses in. It, they clear it and come away with the ball. And now they're on the attack. Looking for the counter attack, but Pavlovic's there to nick the ball off them. Bartolek would throw into wind. I didn't see who that was. Pedri with the header. It's hit the post, I think. And the defender gets it clear. First ten minutes, we're all over them. Brilliant stuff. Great strong start to the game. But can we keep it up? Let's demand a little bit more. Come on, lads. You're playing really well. But let's just give it that little bit more. And if we can nick a goal before half-time, that would be even better. As we have the throw-in. Pavlovic. It's uh, come to Lodi in the end to Pedri, driving forward just wastes it he's got two strikers ahead of him and he just needs to play it through the little gap there to let uh, Jonas Wind run onto it and uh, Jonas Wind would have had a better opportunity I think than Pedri had in that situation and now they're through uh, to have a shot and go, that's a great tackle I can't, come on ref, that's a tackle that's, what's wrong with that it, that clearly won the ball Amazing. We have been robbed there. Absolutely robbed. I'm sorry, but I don't think that was a penalty at all. The refs definitely got that one wrong. That was no penalty at all. Not in my eyes. Come on, lads. Let's see if we can nick an equaliser before half time. We shouldn't be 1 0 down. We're unlucky to be 1 0 down. Bartolek to Jonas Wind. Bartolek out to Batista Meyer. Bartolek. Cross is blocked. And now they're coming down the left wing with the ball. With Correa driving inside and smashes it home for two. I didn't expect them to win it, but to go one nil down to a penalty that <laughs> I don't see don't think there was anything wrong with that tackle to be fair. It's disappointing. Really disappointing. Right. I'm thinking a formation change as well at half time. Loddy, can he nick one in? Oh, he nearly did! He's getting closer. The first free kick he had was inches wide. The second one, that one, just hit the post. Oh, that was so unlucky. Um, stick with the underdogs. I mean, show me something else. It's partly true. I mean, we're just missing the end product. I think unlucky, really. They are playing really well. Not that bad, but can improve. And I'm thinking we go with that tactic, and we that's actually set up perfectly. What's his finishing, Renan Lobby? Eleven finishing. Leave him as winger for a minute then. And I think we've got to push these on to wing backs. Support. Support. And uh, advanced playmaker attack. Yeah, I think that's what we need to do. Um, do to do, do. What else do we need to do? 
maybe something like that. Come on, lads. Come on, let's see if we can uh, at least equalise. Two goals to find, I know, at the moment. But if we can equalise, and that will uh, that'll upset the group even more, won't it? Suta to Sal to Maya Pedri driving forward lays it off to Cortez who has a go I thought that went in I saw the net move it went round the back of the net unlucky Lodi to Cortez come on there's two of you there to nick it off him and you, neither of you get the tackle in Come on, let's push him wide. That will do. Nicely done. It's their corner, though. If they score from this, I've got a feeling it's probably all over. It's a great tackle from Batista Mayer. Jonas Wind gets the ball now. Driving forward. V is a lone striker now. Normally we're playing two up top. Oh, it's Pedri there. If he just aimed slightly left a bit more, it you would have uh, maybe got a better chance oh, what do we do here what do we do I kinda wanna go two up top again but do we do a, a 4 two, two, two? sort of Like this, maybe. Keep him as a ball winning midfielder. Change him to support. Uh, and bring Dennis Dragas on for Cortez, who's having a poor game. And bring bring Bacalo on for Lodi is what I'm thinking or even Maya Maya's starting Maya's fitness is is worse but Maya's also having the better game <sighs> I think we bring Laquintana on for Maya then yeah let's do that Um, want to play a bit wider as well. Uh, don't think we want to change anything else. Let's play and go attacking. Oh, come on then, let's see what happens with this highlight. Come on, let's nick the ball. That's it. Pedri drives forward with the ball now down the right wing, driving into the box. He's going to go himself. Farinez pulls off the save. Dragas lays it back to Lodi. Crosses to he to Laquintana who's just come on and scores one goal. Scores a goal for us. Come on lads. We need one more goal. One more goal. One more goal. One more goal. Let's get the chant going. Come on. It's a great pass from Lodi to pick out Laquintana. And Laquintana first time header. Into the net. Beautiful. He's only just come on the field. Far Walker Farinez, by the way, in goal for Lazio, is the goalkeeper we sold uh, when we brought David David Rea in. Um, we sold Farinez to Real Zaragoza, and I think Farinez joined Lazio the beginning of this season or last season, one of them. So we got a little kickback from that. It wasn't much. It was only um, something like three hundred, four hundred thousand something like that from the salon claws we had but uh, yeah it was a little bit of money but that's where Farinez is now at Lazio so that's uh, that's a bit of a jump up from us isn't it <laughs> right who do we bring on now who do we bring on now Pedri's not having a great game I'm thinking Kylie Bear you know change Kylie Bear to box to box 
that's what I'm thinking. That's what I'm going to do. Kylie Bear, box to box. Where is it there? On support. Uh, yes. And that's what we'll do. We'll go with that. Come on. We've got it in us, lads, to equalise. <gasps> oh, we go so close there. I thought that was it. Come on, lads. Time's ticking away. Time's ticking away. Pause the game. Um, demand more. Attacking. Uh, do we stay attacking? Do we just... Let's drop to positive, I guess. I don't know. I really don't know. Should I have dropped to positive? Should I have kept it attacking? Time's just ticking away. We're not going to equalise. Oh, uh, but we gave it such a... Uh, it's a much better second half. Much, much better. We was unlucky not to get anything from that game. And I think that's what i got to say. Despite the result, I am pleased with the performance in the end. You know, they had a, f a first half penalty that was never a penalty because we won the ball. And that kind of took the steam out of us from there. Then we uh, quickly conceded a second. Uh, give them a boot up the back in the team talk and they managed to play a much better second half. Schalke won their game against Hearts as well. So, uh, yeah. That was a good game. Let's see how that leaves us. We are still top of the table on goal difference. Top of the table on goal difference against Lazio and Schalke. Wowzers. Wowzers, wowzers, wowzers. <laughs> oh. <laughs> We're still top of the table halfway through the group stage. Only on goal difference, mind. But, uh, yeah. And we play Lazio again next, I believe. But, uh, at home. Is that right? Yeah. Play Lazio again at home. Followed by Hearts. And uh, then Schalke away. So, obviously the perfect scenario is we come away with a win against Lazio next. But, hopefully we can at least get the draw with Lazio. If we get the draw with Lazio, then that will keep us in the, in the hunt for getting through to the group stage. But a loss against them could knock a wind right out of us for the second half of the group stage. Because I'm expecting Chilka to beat Hearts again. Um, yeah. But anyway, I guess that remains to be seen. That will be the next episode. Is going to be... Let's see when that is, actually. That's just down here. So probably do Lazio and Athletic Madrid. Real Sporting and Hearts in the next one. Um, yeah. If not before, then it's probably going to be next weekend's uploads. And once again, it will be two uploads next weekend. If uh, if that's the way it works. Depends if I get time to do the midweek one or not. But anyway, you've had two, we uh, two uploads this weekend. So uh, there we are. If you did enjoy that, leave a thumbs up. Comment down below what you thought of the results of how we played just say hi in general whatever uh, subscribe if you're new and uh, bell notifications to let you know when I go again and don't forget my Twitter thank you very much for watching bye for now <laughs>